everyone welcome back to the second episode thanks be over the next day when i woke up around 7:30 am my roommate is already left i bring all his things with me since morning so i i, I no need to go back to the apartment after the lunch time i go up to pass the books and projects sample i just focus on to find joke again in the classroom a bit difficult to find him because a lot of people in the classroom suddenly someone rises and it's hobby him he is walking out of classroom get to me i will submit it for joke who be him said he is not in class i ask Yesterday he has a date with someone that's why since morning he is not coming to class don't know where he gone today hobi young said um, i smiled at him but i can't really call it a smile at all i feel something your smile says everything ha huh. You are mad at him, right? He asked you to bring it all here, and he is gone on a date. But that's how he is. Cannot change. Sometimes we also need to do it for him, cause he always went out for some reason and asked us to help. We have patted my shoulder. No, no, him. Why should I mad at him? I am willing to do so. for uh, him uh, i'm late already i have a class at 1:30 see you okay okay see you there hang he say he is going in his class and i rush down to my classroom i need to admit that i am interested in my roommate yes i am a boy who is in love i am a boy who is not into girls i am scared that people may will know who i am i am scared that they would see me as a disabled person i am scared that nobody want to talk to me anymore if they find out i am scared that i would be alone at the end i am not confident enough to come out even now that i like or have crush on at jungkook see i need to hide it i don't want him to discuss me and there is no way that a straight man like jungkook him would love me back but still i feel bad after who we him told me that jungkook him is went on a date it's already 11 6:30 in the evening and i went back to the apartment i opened the door halfway and the scene in front of me made my eyes made my heart ache and i have no energy to walk in i see he like someone grabbing my heart forcefully don't you know You should knock the door before you came in. My roommate shouted at me. Uh, I I just came in without knocking as usual. Young, I I'm sorry. I quickly closed the door back and I stand in outside of the room to keep myself calm. A while later, the door is open and the lady coming out first before Jungkook him. Go in. I will go and send her off first. Young told me, "Yes, him." I quickly went inside into the room and locked it. I feel like dying inside. My hand has cold as ice, and I cannot move my legs. Just sit down and leave, leaning back on the door. I saw him with the girl sitting so close and holding hands. It's like. Looks like they were about to kiss, but why I felt bad and I was about to cry. Knock, knock. Hey, hey! I didn't bring the key with me. Open the door. I tried to stand up with all my force and open the door. Why? Your face is so red. Sigh, shocked. But next time, knock the door first, okay? I don't want you to say something that a kid like you shouldn't.
He told me while going on to his bed. I called him. Hmm. I passed the books today. Yeah, Hobby told me. They already submitted. Thanks. They. Jungkook Young, I don't know why I keep calling him. Actually, I don't really have a topic to say. He looked at me without saying anything. The house cleaning. I always do it alone on weekends, I said. So, Young asked, Rajin and I, bro, can you do together with me? On every weekend, I ask, Dad, don't even know what I am talking about, Frank Chang. You will get scolded for sure. Huh? Who ask you to do? Do you do it yourself or let it be? I don't care. Young said, shrug off, but you also stay in the room. I simply told him. Okay, then let's play a game if you want i will do together with you but if i want you have to do cleaning along and alone and also need to do my laundry when the basket is full jungkook king asked what game i asked back he staring without blinking he said and bent his face forward to my face i am dead how can i win this game i always try to avoid eye contact with him okay he start i still haven't replied to him but he already start the game jungkook king is looking in my eyes straight without blinking his face move move closer to my face and his smile ah, i can't i close my eyes tightly Young patted my head and said he lost the then he put his one hand on my shoulder and another hand pointing to the laundry basket see my laundry basket it's already full go and do it for me now i nodded sighing as i lost the game and now bring myself to this it is all because of my stupid heart and the what can i say more i bring the basket laundry basket to go downstairs laundry room junk xpo we have woke up early and prepare everything to go to school i can't get out of the kid i am thanks socks face sock face in my eyes the whole night his sock face keep on popping in my mind actually i bring the girl to my apartment after dating us i see is pretty and we talk for a while sitting on the bed and i was about to pick my phone that i put on the bed behind her from someone else view it would look like i was getting closer and about to kiss but no i'm not going to kiss her i just don't want to kiss anyone i want to kiss i want it with someone special and unfortunately the door open i saw the kid's face he is so shocked he didn't say a word but his mouth wide open and looking at me his is no skin turn into tomato red tomato color i knew what he thought about our position that we were about to kiss and i play along teasing him a bit it was cute i was thinking about it while brushing my teeth he came into the bathroom with his half closed eyes hey hey kid i'm here are you going to step over my head i raised my voice uh, morning here i will wait outside you do first he stepped it out then grabbed his hand and pulled me pull him in the came in i am already done i is just standing near the study table and waited for the kid to come out as i prepare already prepared my bag before washing my face the yes jungkook you have morning class let's go together as we have to go some building same building he look at me innocently yeah he looks so innocent and pure i feel so guilty that i teach him about the naughty thoughts of mine yes please wait 5 minutes young i do i will do faster he rushes to change his uniform and puts his book 
Then let's go jump down hill. Nodded my head and then I nodded my head and going out in front of him. Suddenly my phone rang. Hello, Cook. I'm downstairs now. Okay, okay. I am coming down now. I hang up the phone and look at him. Sorry, hey, the girl from tomorrow is downstairs now. I think I have to go first. You can go yourself, right? I ask again. Apologizing him. It is my first time to say sorry to someone, but I feel like doing it. Yes, Jungkook King, I'm okay. He smiled at me and answered. I feel so happy inside to leave this kid behind. I don't know why I feel guilty. Actually, it's not my style to care how other people feel, but thanks be away. I don't move a single step after him left i'm so tired of stay sharing this room with him my heart is so painful and already broken into pieces the night yesterday night i can't sleep well as i feel like someone grabbed my heart it's hurt seeing him with someone else my tear dropped over my face without warning it keep on dropping i want I want to over it. I want to stop it. It's too painful for me to handle it. It's too painful to secretly falling in love with that hot bad boy. And now maybe he is a playboy too. Next day things will be since it's Saturday. I just don't let myself wake up early and she still lying down on the bed. Bed. Eyes closed. Um, let's meet at ten thirty. Okay, bye. Maybe he is talking with his girlfriend. I check my phone to know the time. It's nine a.m. in the morning. I took my notebook beside my bed and sit up on the bed and read a page by page. The first page are the first person I met. I and my heart fluttered when I called. When he called, you called me. Kid, but you don't even look at me in my eyes. The second page, Jungkook. See, can I call it destiny of it? I saw you again in the assigned room, and you asked me to move out. But I still want to be in this room because I just want to stay near you. The third page. Hey, dear Hyung. Yeah, I like it calling you Jungkook Hyung. You also. Ask me to call you young. The moment when our faces are so close, I don't dare to look into your eyes. I can I can feel butterflies in my stomach, and I don't know if I would embarrass myself if I look at him in in his eyes. The fourth page, dear young. I saw you about to kiss a girl today. My heart is so in pain. I lied on the bed and cried a lot. I blanked out a few minutes. I think I love you more than I know. The fifth page. Hey, hey, get you awake. When I reached the fifth page, I heard Jungkook Hyung call me. As he can clearly see, I am sitting on the bed when he came out of the bathroom. Yes, him just now. I answered him. From up stairs and close the my diary. When I follow us to the library with Youngie Jimin and Hobby to study, did I hear correctly? So he is talking to his friends by others. Yes, I will come along with you. I rushed on the bed slowly. I wouldn't catch you if you fall. Yes, I let's go. Hmm. To where? You still not wash your face and brush your teeth. It's okay. I will do it fast. Don't you just go and do now? Now you talk to me already. Is smelling go go fast? Yeah, I am going. But later you will go without me. Now nine th- nine ten a.m. I told them to meet ten thirty a.m. You still have time to do, and their room is just beside us. Go and do now. Don't waste your time, dirty little kid. It's not me. You are the dirty, but I will not say it aloud. Hmm. 
I go into the bathroom while he is putting his books into his bag. I'm done here. Let's go. Jungkook him knock the door of his friend's room. Young Jimin and Hobi, yeah, coming. Let's go. Sleeping cat Hobi. Young started looking at Young Hyung while locking the door and coming out of the room. Hmm, little one, they hung. Will follow us? Young Hyung looked at me and asked. I look at him and bow. Yes, he was just sitting home alone. So I called him to join us. Jungkook Hyung told them. Hey, Kirk, when you become such a responsible person for your junior, Jimmy asked, I am such a good person since day one, don't you know, Jimmy, huh? My roommate talked back to him while we were walking. When we reached the library, all of them go and take the books. I took my seat a bit far from them as there were only four seats and they all sat together i placed my bag on the chair and going to get the books when i came back i saw my roommate jungkook young who is reading a book it's kind of hard not to stare at him as he looked extra attractive with that serious look i just stared at him he has no idea he has no clothes, Uncle can keep on focusing on his book. I keep my feeling down inside my heart. The more I hide and let my feeling die, the more I fall for him. No matter what had happened, no matter what he has done, no matter what he will do. I know he has a girlfriend, but still I will always love him. I swear it, I know. I sound Pabu, but I am Pabu in love. This is in for today. I know this was short, but still I hope you will love it as I have a lot of work to do and less time. So I and and I also want to keep updated daily. So I have to make a short episode, but I hope you will enjoy it and understand my situation okay see you again with the next episode i'll take care of self bye bye